Got one rockfish. Looks like a starry eye or one nice rockfish right there on that bucktail. Nice quality fish. Steam this guy up, he'll taste delicious. All right, we'll take a little break and see if we can get another one. Larger oh. bonito. There's a nice bonita. Here's that bonita I just caught. Caught him on a live anchovy. He's trying to catch a calico. And he caught a bonita here. And that's what's neat about fishing these kelp areas. You never know if it's gonna be a calico. Could be a sand bass on the edge, a halibut down there. Maybe even the yellowtail or white sea bass. And today was a nice big bonita. Biggest bonita of the day so far. We got Destin here. Got a very nice salmon grouper. He just pulled off the bottom. We're fishing about 32 fathoms just outside of uh, little Gibraltar here. It's your first salmon grouper? Yeah, absolutely. Right on. He did a very good job. Put his rod on the rail, steady wound it all the way to the boat. Follow directions. We got a nice killer little salmon grouper. Good job, brother. Thanks a lot. Right. There's a little calico bass. And the skipper just made a move. He's got, here to see that. This is a Garibaldi. This is a state fish. You can't keep this fish. But uh, very rarely do you see a state fish caught ever by hook. And there's one right there. Okay, we're going to go ahead and release that guy. Here's, here's a little calico that I caught. Okay, the giant. See what kind of fish this is. Looks like a calico. There we go. So it's not a big calico. And not every trip you're going to get monster fish. See that little anchovy I was using? But it's good to always practice a technique and get used to fishing correctly. And that's all we're doing. This, you know, today I'm getting the smaller calicos. Next trip it might be six pounders or eight pounders. But it's all the same technique. It's just a different size hook, maybe heavier line next time, maybe bigger bait. Time of year, right now it's fall, and uh, the water's starting to get a little bit colder, but we're still getting them on live bait. All right, let's take a little break from the action here at Catalina Island board the Gale Force. And when we return, I'll be giving you this week's tip of the week. Did you know that an adult Garibaldi can grow up to 14 inches, 7 inches, or 21 inches long? That's right, the correct answer is 14 inches. 